Welcome back to Let's Play Toho Mother! Now, before we get going, there is one thing I would like to say. In everything that ever existed, one thing that fans absolutely love doing is pairing up characters for relationships. Toho is no different. However, since every character in Toho is female, that this led to the phrase, everyone in Toho is gay. None of this is canon at all, but it is a fairly big part of the Toho universe, and oddly, it it's not weird or anything. It actually comes across as being somewhat cute. So, I would like to say before we get going here that supposedly Pacholi has a crush on Marissa. But, Marissa, it's not that she doesn't know, it's more that she's Marissa. She has more important things on her mind, like stealing Pacholi's books. So yeah, I just thought I'd throw that out there for everyone. Now then, we are off to find... Ramelia. Well, that was quick. Sakuya. Yeah, that doesn't look much like... Well, I suppose it kind of is Sakuya, but she's got a weird mask on. She's not acting quite like normal. Not really. Okay, fine. What were you thinking about, Marissa? Leaving? Within a very short distance, we have our third boss fight. Well, if you want to count Cyrano. Now, you'll see that Reimu and Marissa are both in the party, and Pacholi's there off to the side, whereas Yuka, on the other hand, was actually in one of the uh, four main boxes. This means that she will be one of our four main characters. And she, sometimes she'll be more helpful than others. More beams! Okay, this is kind of the deal with the uh, Sakuya fight. She'll occasionally throw out a card, which she says is a Taro card. It's actually a Yu-Gi-Oh card. Um, bonus points to anyone that can tell me what card. And there you go. I have deemed, however, that you can watch it and know when it's upside down and hit it at the right time, but I've deemed that completely unimportant. It's actually completely random whether or not it's upside down or not. If you get really lucky, you can beat this whole battle without getting hit once. Aha! Twice! More beams! It goes down consistently enough that I tend to think that it does have... Whoa. I can target other things. 
It goes down consistently enough that you think it may actually have something to do with when you press it, but I don't know how many times I've hit it, like, right at the bottom, and it goes up anyway. Kind of like that time. Ow. I wonder what happens if I attack the other things that I can target. Darn it. Okay, you know what? We haven't seen PK Dream yet. Turn it all! I'd like to have a turn, please! Nifty. I should do that more often. But first, let's make sure Marissa doesn't die. Oh, and if you get really low on life, Pacholi will do this, which cures you up real nice. Uh, 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 uh. Darn it. Why, oh, why did I have Marissa melee? Darn it. I suppose they have Patchouli in there to make sure you don't just get fooged over because you can't attack out of the random number generator. Darn it! Okay, I don't think it matters. I'm pretty sure it doesn't matter when... Alright! Um, another one of these, because I can. If Patchouli gets off an ice spell, that does a buttload of damage. <laughs>